And then we broke up. I was driving myself crazy because I wanted her so bad, but I just couldn't be with her. I didn't see you oh, guys there. We're about to kiss in front of you guys. Welcome back to our channel. So today we have some oh, exciting oh, news. Oh, it's a cute sense oh, of... Oh, hold up, hold up. Whoa, oh, Bill just God. went into like, it's like Let pouring. Let me just give you a quick pause really quick. It is freaking pouring Look out. Look at this. Like, I can't even really see. It's already flooding. It's flooding on the road right now. This video is going to be one of the most important videos. It's a video you guys have been waiting for for a long time. Now, besides all the pranks besides all the challenges we wanted to give you an insight on our actual relationship and how our first date was we're going to take you guys to our first date we want to take our marble squad something fun we want to show you this is the same day we had our first kiss oh yeah it got a little crazy that day but it's a kind of a low-key place i know a lot of you are gonna love this place that we're going to already like some yeah. people are obsessed with this place but, but this was just where we decided to go it means a lot it does mean a lot low-key every time i go here I think of us going there for the first time. I know, and we order the same exact thing. When he, go, he goes, what do you want? I go, I want this. And he goes, no way. He goes, All I right. get the same thing. Should we explain that now? Maybe we should. All right, so we went to this place, right? And we ordered a drink. It's a fast food place. So comment down below before we get there what place do you think it is. But we got here, and Mariah told me, hey, can you order this for me? And I'm like, no freaking way. I we got get the, the same, same thing. thing. That was how we just connected on our first date but anyways thank you guys so much for being subscribed to us if you are not already make sure to go down and hit that subscribe button make sure to turn on your bell notification so you guys get notified every, every single, single time, time we post. post and once you do those two things make sure to comment down below when done, done. let's get this video to 25,000 likes let's yes. do it for love for our love and your love as a family if you're part of the marvel squad make sure you give this video a big thumbs up and let's get this video to 25,000 likes i know you guys have been crushing it i see it i see the place actually oh, oh my god here we are this is insane everyone we're rolling up on it right now we're probably 30 seconds down the road and oh my god this is crazy it's bringing back so many memories because like this is where it all kind of started so bill's sister before we got here said that the place that we were going to was temporarily closed and i was gonna get really mad and be like i was it's be, closed what? we were gonna get so upset but, but the it's open it's open all right guys in three two, two one, one. Starbucks. I know it isn't something that's super like sentimental no, and like it is. It is a date night. This is where our Marvel family started. It really literally. did. What's crazy is when we came here, Bill goes, "What do you want?" And I go, "I like vanilla no, bean frappuccino, frappuccino with, with caramel, caramel throughout. throughout." And he I was goes, like, "Oh my god, me too." Yeah, it was the cutest thing. Oh, while we wait in the Starbucks drive-through, we want to give the answer to the last video, end of the video question that we asked you all. I told you three things, and one of them was a lie. I told you I was a cheerleader. I broke my arm on the monkey bars. And and he or was adopted. I was adopted. And, and a lot you, of you guys had, it was between cheerleader and adopted. Here's the thing. I don't think they want to believe that I was ever a cheerleader. I don't think they want to believe that But I don't think either. they believe that I was adopted either. That was the main thing. Yeah, those were the main two. I only had a few people that said monkey bar, but we're going to reveal it. You guys ready? The answer of the last video's question was... I was not adopted. You guys all got it. Who said I was not adopted? He I kind of exposed myself here. He I was did. a cheerleader when I was little. Um, I cheered in the same group as my sisters. <laughs> yeah, that happened, and now we're going to get over it. <laughs> yeah, so he was a cheerleader. Make sure you guys stay tuned for the end of the video because I'm going to do two truths and one lie, and I know you guys really enjoyed yes. that last time. If you did not know, at the end of every video, we do do an end of the video question for all those that have not watched our videos to the end, so make sure to get ready for hers today because I'm, I'm excited. excited. This star Starbucks line is hecka long. Crazy. Say, if you guys don't know this, Bill will always on TikTok, he'll be like, this is hecka, well, we're I doing hecka wanna, strong. I want to say hello. And I like that. This is going to um, be crazy. We need to get some breakfast food because I am starving and I I'm getting agree, a little but angry. I don't know what they have and there's four people behind us so we have to be lickety split. We don't have to be lickety split. What are you taking pictures of? It looks intense. <laughs> For YouTube. Oh, you guys are on YouTube? Yeah. yeah. There you go. I appreciate it. Have a great Thank day. Thank you. Looks good. Hey, Starbucks was like low-key hella protective she had a coffee mug that she put those in so she didn't touch comment them at all. down below what you guys like to get from starbucks any of them anything Just like cake pop what you guys so basically we're doing exactly what we did on our first day we literally parked in the starbucks drive-thru and it drank was, our vanilla frappuccino it was so nerve-wracking we first it was found awkward. out it was so no actually it really wasn't i think what we were most worried about was like our first kiss and we were thinking about that the whole time like when is he gonna kiss me when is he gonna kiss me Low i think everyone. that's when it was really like made us the most nervous 
I don't know if you had had your first kiss yet. I'm sure a have, lot of you guys have it. That's it's okay awesome. if you have it. If you have it, it is the most nerve wracking thing ever because we were both thinking it at the same time, but we just didn't want to do it just because like we were nervous. It literally took that night. Her sister was like, just do it, just do it. And she was like pressuring us to do it. She came downstairs and she was like, he gets kissed yet? And I go, I go, no. He was like, why? Why haven't you done it yet? Why? Oh my God. And then Sapil goes, finally, she just said, screw it and just grabbed my face <laughs> and kissed me. But that was under peer pressure. Don't do that because it makes it even worse. Wait, boom. You're crazy. Hmm? That literally feels like it was yesterday. I mean, it really does. think about it. Like, it didn't think... That that was three years ago. You know how long three years It's is? like what your mom and dad always say. Like, your life's gonna just flash by. Like, high school's already done. Four years of high school. We're out. Like, we're done with high school. We've already been dating for three years. Like, that. Also, we are gonna be going to Florida in June. Oh, Comment yes. Comment down below the couple you guys think that we are meeting up with. Everyone, just like Mariah said, we are gonna be going to vacation down in Florida for about a week. And we are gonna be meeting up with another YouTube Two couple. couple. So... Who do you think that YouTube couple is? It's nobody that we featured on our channel yet. No, they have nobody not been yet. in any of our videos. New to the Marvel Squad. So me and my baby are gonna finish our drinks. We're gonna finish our food in where we first dated. It's crazy how far we came and yeah. how much we grew with you guys. And that's the main thing that I wanted to get across is we would not be able to do it without you. And mm. we're able to bring you along anywhere we go on our anniversaries, our wedding, our like kids, anything. You all are gonna be able to experience it with us firsthand. When we get home, Stay tuned for the rest Woo! of the video. We have a lot of things we want to talk about. That's the best part of the video. This is gonna be the best part of the video. It's about how we first met, things that we have gone through together as a couple. Things that we've broken up. Yeah, and there's just everything to kind of give you guys also relationship advice and just talking about how we met and all the time you guys want us to do an updated video. And I know we've done this on our channel once, but we're gonna explain more in detail because we've already come so far. And you can see that not every relationship is what it seems like. No. Not every relationship is picture perfect, freaking white house picket fence you know we've had some roller coaster you oh, know speed yeah. bumps along the way that a lot of you don't even know about so stay tuned don't go anywhere get your popcorn get your drinks Ooh. get whatever you need this is gonna be lit so we're gonna finish up here and make our way back home and we'll see you then Woo! bye So we are currently back home. It seems like forever since we talked to you because we, we actually did a T25 workout. We did an ab workout today. Oh my gosh, it did intense. it have me burning. So we're back and we have something so sentimental. I found this in my room and this is perfect for this video. This basically, the whole video revolves around this one book. So before we even show you guys the book, it gives we're gonna give- every time we talk about I this. I know. Literally. So basically what happened was I worked at a grocery store called Burkhaz. We're actually starting to lose hours and I was like, I can't do this. I need more money. I need more more hours so I decided to apply at Mariano's so my sister got a job a week early before me and said you should apply at Mariano's they're hiring so I applied I actually went into Mariano's and I told them that I applied because my sister told me to come in the manager actually told me that she'll give me a call back which, which is bogus. you know if a, someone says that that means you did not get the job yeah, for those who are looking for jobs or for those who are old enough that already have jobs you know if they say oh we'll call you back 90% of the time they're not gonna call you back and honestly they might but in our case I knew that they wouldn't have so my sister actually told the manager that I just came in and they were like, oh my God, bring her back in. So if it wasn't for my sister, I would have never gotten the job. So, so where she's going with this though, is she got the job at Mariano's. I already worked there for five months before the twins came along, her and her sister. Actually, I was low key flirting with her sister at They first. were low key feeling, I'm like, no, he is mine. I called yeah. dibs. We I started was talking first, that's why. I know, I was starting to fight with my sister. I'm like, no, cause really? he bought her cookies and I had to pay him back the next day. Yeah. So he actually came to my register and I gave him $5 and I'm like, oh my God, he is the cutest kid and ever. I was actually low key nervous when I was going up to collect that money because you were like, you know, obviously very pretty and stuff yeah. and I didn't want to like make a fool of myself. But ever since then, we just started like looking at each other while working and we were just flirting it up. I'm not even kidding. I fell in love with him the second I saw him. <laughs> I would listen to music in the car and I would get butterflies thinking about you. Think about like, me? Yes. Uh, I don't know what it was, but I had this insane attraction to you that I just wanted more. I'm so glad that now I have you three years later. So basically, Basically, we met at a grocery store. I was a cashier. He was a bagger. So whenever I would cashier, Bill would do this thing where he would make like these really funny noises. I'd be like, mm. and it would be the funniest thing she ever. She would start dying laughing while she was like trying to do the customers. She'd be checking people out, and I'd be like, mm. 
And she'd like, be like cracking oh, up. That was like our way of flirting. Yeah, that was our flirting stage. We had a blast yeah. together. It was the most funnest thing. When we were at Starbucks earlier, we were talking about how we were inside having our first kiss. That was our first kiss. Like this is all this flirting Mariana stuff before we even went to Starbucks. You know, Starbucks yeah. was our first official date and that night was our first kiss. Everything leading up to this point in the video, this is the highlight right here. We actually have pictures of our first YouTube photo pictures and our first ever picture we took after we kissed that night that we were talking about you at Starbucks. So this is from 2017 through 2018. I think we started YouTube 2018. Yeah, this is a book that Mariah made me for our one year this anniversary. This picture was our first YouTube picture. This is when we first started getting into social media and like getting used to like taking photos. So before we show you this picture, the first date night that we had that we took you guys to Starbucks in the beginning of the video, this was the same night we had our first kiss. Three years ago. And these are our first pictures you yes. guys ready to see are this? you ready pictures after i think we had our first kiss yeah this is right after so these are the pictures on her couch we were kind of just chilling there that is right after we had our this first says, kiss these were the first photos we've ever taken together something i'll always remember and cherish because we were both super shy but had the best time together that's so cute <laughs> give me a kiss <laughs> so these are some of our pictures that we took and we're going to show you one more picture out of this book because this means the world this is when we actually started our youtube channel before we had tiktok before we even were anything on instagram this is the first of our social media career these pictures so bill's sister Brittany actually came and took these pictures for us. And, and we wrote it down. That's how we know this is our first pictures for our YouTube channel. It says, I love this memory because we started a YouTube channel and we have so come so far with it. We love being behind the camera and filming all of our memories that we will one day cherish in our future. Being able to live this life with you is a true blessing. <laughs> oh, wait, that's actually so cute. It makes me want to cry. Here's some more pics that we took. Like, oh my god. So basically this book is the start of our relationship and the start of our YouTube career. That's why we wanted to bring it out because this is literally our foundation right here. Moral of the story, we just want to say thank you so much for everyone that has came this far. We are about to hit half a million subscribers. We're at 450K and it's just crazy to think how far we've came in these two years of social media and how far we're going to grow. And I'm so glad we can do it with all of you supporting us, watching us, and just being amazing every day. And what's insane to us is we said when we were full time we're gonna see a really big change in our oh, channel yeah. and honestly we've only been full time for a month a, a month, month and a half and we've already grown almost 300,000 in this last month it just shows what what you can do once you put your full attention. mind and attention into something we are so happy like I don't look at it as a number I don't no. look at it as like we have 500,000 people no I, we have 500,000 amazing Marvel Squad members like we are just so excited and for every single one of you I never in a million years would have thought starting at a grocery store we would end up here yeah. and everyone who we're so on us, people that try to discourage us in the beginning. I'm so glad we, we didn't we've listen. We've gotten so much hate, so, so much. much bullying, unnecessary from people being jealous, just haters. You know what I mean? From like, people from our work, friends. people from friends. But we know what was great about me and Bill is we never listened. Then we kept going. We, we took that. It. We took that hate and we put it into motivation. So we just want to give a huge thank you to you guys for supporting us and coming along our journey. I really hope you guys enjoyed our little story time and how we met and coming with us to our first date. I feel like it's so cool. We we told you how we first met and we told you and showed you our first date. So now you can just get a better understanding of our relationship and where we are as people. And I also wanted to mention one more thing. Since the start, we've always had a slogan. Oh, it was yes. slowly but, but surely. surely. And we've been saying that from the, the before start. we even had one follower. I think it's actually on your computer. He has a little sticky note that yeah. he put while he was editing. It says slowly but surely. And that was our day one. It's still in our Instagram bios yeah, too. I we've had that in here since in we were under a thousand followers on Instagram like we literally grew slowly in the beginning and we are so thankful for how it all went about because it made us even more thankful for what we had instead of just blowing up right away we literally said slowly but surely we're gonna get there slowly but surely keep working hard and I'm really glad that you know we had to work hard to get to where we are because I feel like if we got it handed to us we wouldn't be as appreciative oh, of yeah, no, everything sure. that we've done and I'm just so glad we went through all of that mess yeah. to get it here. makes you appreciate it more if you get if you just blow up in one day you don't appreciate your followers as much as you would if you just slowly grew that and put in the work and that's mm -hmm. where we are at that's why we love showing love to you guys that's why we always love reading your comments and liking through all them and even DMing some of you guys back it is really hard to get back to everybody and I don't want you guys to think we're ignoring you it is just really hard yeah. and we try our hardest that's like one of the things that me and Bill always want to keep the same as we grow is to try to get back to every single one of you obviously that's impossible but we're gonna try but to we make that a main thing in our day we spend hours every day liking comments and responding to comments just 
solely to give back to you. We don't want to just throw out content. We want to have a community and talk with you. But so, yes, Marvel Squad. On that note, we um, hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Like you said at the beginning of the video, 25,000 likes. 000. Let's get this video to 25,000 likes for our first date, our first time we met, and yes. everything. Also, our video is almost at 30,000 oh, likes no. on our last video, so oh, I might no. be shaving his eyebrow What's next it video. At? 26, it's at 26,800 likes. By I the might time, be shaving your eyebrow. By the time this video posts tomorrow, it's gonna be at 30,000. That's crazy. No! Ah! She's, gonna, she's gonna put a slit. All right, pick which eye. Which eye should she put a slit in? My right eye or my left eye? You yeah, guys get to pick in this that. video. Comment down below what eye. So before we end the video, we do have to give our end, end the video, video post, post notification shout out. out. And this shout out goes to SI12MN. Shout out to you, SI. She commented, who else loved that they actually spent time liking basically That's all the funny. comments. That's funny. We just talked about I that. I know. Literally, we try so hard to like all of your comments. So do not feel left out if we don't. We literally get thousands of comments. So we try to like through as many as we can. But if you don't get your comment liked, don't worry. Try the next video. We will eventually get around to everyone. Yes. So before we leave, one last thing. We do a question at the end of every video for those who are supportive to watch our videos to the end. Well, last video we did two truths and one lie for me. So today we're gonna switch it up and do the same thing for Mariah. Yes. So she's gonna tell you two truths and one lie and you have to comment down which one you think is the lie out of these three things that she's gonna say. Are you ready? So the first answer is I've played hockey before. The second one is I have a twin. And the third one is I've gone into a car crash. So comment down below which one was a lie out of those three and we will tell you in the next video whether you are right or not. So make sure to comment which one you think is a lie down below. Thank you so much for watching our videos all the way through. You guys are literally real Mobber Squad members. We love you and we will see you in the next, next video. video. But until, until then, then, peace. I love you. Oh, just kidding, you thought we were gonna kiss. Oh. <laughs>